Right, welcome to week number five for Dave. Uh, it says the audio is connecting, Dave. So hopefully it will connect in a couple of seconds. I think I can hear you now. Great. And I can hear you as well. Welcome, Dave. <laughs> Finally. Don't you just love all these lovely technical issues? Marvellous, isn't it? It's like the start of lockdown one all over again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, don't say that. <laughs> right. So first of all, happy belated birthday. Thank you. Likewise to you. I was just explaining to everybody. The problem is when you have a birthday on a Thursday, it seems to last the Friday, the Saturday and the Sunday, doesn't it? Uh, well, it does when it started on the Monday as well. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> yeah, so let's just remind everybody, this time last week, you had lost your stone, hadn't you? Which is great. I had. Yeah, I had. Yeah. And, an actual fact, it was two and a half weeks, wasn't it? You'd actually lost it a few uh, days before your official weight. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And I've got a bit of work to do again now. <laughs> <laughs> right now you don't need to share exactly how much you put on if you don't want to but uh how good was your birthday well if, if i if i run down the week you'll probably understand i've got a bit of work to do so so monday night <laughs> monday night i was taken out by some customers for a chinese so uh so that wasn't great tuesday we had a taster menu at um derby conference center which was an afternoon tea Oh, so, lovely. So, so it was lovely, but there was there was lots of stuff we needed to taste. <laughs> that was Tuesday. Wednesday, I was invited out with some friends that we couldn't see at the weekend. So I went to the pub with a couple of mates of mine and came back with a belly full of Guinness. Thursday, and that was Wednesday. <laughs> that was Wednesday. Yeah. Thursday was birthday meal out, obviously, and a few drinks. And we also had lunch out too. So that was before the evening meal. Friday, yeah. Friday was not so bad to be honest. Didn't have alcohol, I don't think. Friday, or if I did, it wasn't much. And then Saturday, we had a, a, a gathering around ours and uh, quite a few friends around, and we were drinking till about half two in the morning. So I don't think on any of those particular days I lost a lot of weight. <laughs> <laughs> but I did say right at the start, right at the start, I said that week will be whatever that week will be, yeah. and I'll pay the price for that. And, and recoup it over the next week yeah so that's fine you know mentally this is what it's all about you know just being able to take take your foot off the gas and actually enjoy yourself so yeah no problem whatsoever so what what i will commit to and having had a strong day today i'll commit to getting right back to where i was by saturday by saturday yeah right so we're going to weigh in again on saturday morning yeah great yeah. Uh, which i might just add to everybody that is your normal way in day isn't it you've yeah. obviously just weighed in this morning because uh you were enjoying the weekend <laughs> <laughs> actually i weighed in um i think it was wednesday morning i weighed in after i've had two sort of two of the bad experiences if you like but nice experiences but from a health point of view yeah. um and i'd only put a pound on at that stage so i was quite happy with that wow that is good but um, yeah, it's. Uh, I, I will send you a message tomorrow. Well, I'll send you a message every day. I'll weigh every day. But I think because the weight's gone on quickly, I expect it to come off fairly quickly if I get back into the right routines. Absolutely. So this morning, this morning was a six and a half k walk. This evening's been a four k walk. Great. Um, I'm into my third liter of water today. Um, porridge for breakfast. Five rye vita and pate at lunch with some grapes, um, blackberries, uh, sorry, blackberries, black blueberries uh, in the porridge, by the way. Um, and then this evening's meal has been um, homemade five bean chili with brown rice. So perfect. I and no snacks or anything? No snacks or anything today. And my calorie intake is just over a thousand calories so far today. And my exercise is just over a thousand calories as well. So actually today I've done nothing. <laughs> Which is great. <laughs> you've actually burnt off everything you've eaten so far, yes. which is perfect. 
yeah, so I expect to see a, a result tomorrow morning. So apart from, really from apart from looking in today's food diary, I'm guess there's guessing there's no other entries, is there? I, I didn't put any entries in last week. <laughs> <laughs> Just it's, it didn't seem appropriate. <laughs> Which again, it also is, you know, mentally, it's good to have a break from doing monotonous things like yeah. tracking your food. So that all goes yeah. part and parcel. So that's fine. The thing is that this this six weeks, as much as as much as I'm doing it for you and the competitive nature and everything else, I'm doing it for me. So yeah. whatever I've caused a problem with last week is a problem that I've caused myself. So it's now down to me to put that right. I like this style, Dave. This is great. Well, I'm only accountable to myself, aren't I? You know, what goes in my mouth is not food for sped. So <laughs> very true. So it's all about choices. And and if you're doing it for yourself, you've only got yourself to hold account to. Yeah, that's so true. Right. So what did you do exercise, by the way, last week? Uh, walked quite a bit still, to be honest. Um, and we did a, uh, how far did we run on Saturday? I think we did 10K on Saturday. So that was trying to alleviate what was going to happen on Saturday night. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, yeah, I'll do a bit more running this week, probably go for a run in the morning, um, but definitely looking to up the step count or up the calorie calorie burning count this week and keep the um, food choices sensible. Now, up until uh, today, you were also the biggest loser of the course so far. Uh, but you may have seen that Chelsea has overtaken you quite considerably now. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, yeah. Yeah, excellent. That is brilliant. So she, she lost nine pounds this week, which takes her up to 21 pounds, which is a stone and a half. Um, but actually, in fact, if you got a stone and a half, you'd actually be over your event end goal, wouldn't you? I would, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, so there's a bit to do. I need I need to get myself back to where I was as soon as possible. And then, well, my, my plan is to have two mega focused weeks and just do the best I possibly can to get as low as I possibly can. Uh, we can do this, Dave. I've got no, no I've got no doubt in my mind that you are going to achieve this. Yeah. I'll, I will finish lower than I was last Saturday. <laughs> sure, I shan't let that not happen. Even if after I'm safe, one of my legs. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. So you're going to let me know on Saturday your weight, and then we'll discuss it uh, again live on our video next Monday. Yeah. Yeah. Great. And I'll give, you, I'll give you some updates down the week between you and I, some private message updates. Please do. Every day. You know, I love to hear about it. Yeah. Yeah, and, and the food diary will be going in there, so you can see that too. Yeah, I can see it's in today as well, so you're already back into the routine. Yeah. Great. Well, thank you very much, Dave. Thank you, Jody. I will speak to you next week. You will indeed. Have a great week. Good great. luck to everybody this week, and uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to catch Chelsea up now, but uh, I'll do my best. We just need you to hit goal. We don't need You don't need to be the biggest loser. you just got to hit your no. goal. That's the only yeah, issue. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Right, well done. Perfect. See you soon, Jody. Bye, Dave. Bye.